Hello, I'm Mira from Alaya Pilates. This is a shoulder and arm strengthening class. We'll be doing a full body workout Pilates class, focusing on building strength and muscle around the shoulders and the arm. So what we need today is a long scarf like so, or towel, a thin towel. Okay, so let's get started. We're going to start kneeling up. So put the scarf away. All right, so we're gonna start like so, and then we're just gonna roll the shoulder for now. So we're gonna roll it back just to warm up that shoulder because we've been doing a lot of work on them. Okay, back one more, and then we go forward. Just keeping nice and loose and easy. All right, let's go three more. And okay, right, let's get your scarf. All right, so I want you to bring the scarf in front of you or the towel, okay? So if you have a long one, in fact, you know what? You can fold it in half like so, here, like so. Okay, now I need to draw that TA muscle, so the transverse abdominus muscle, pull it up, draw that pelvic floor muscle up, and from here, I want you to think about pulling apart the towel or the scalp. So like so, as you breathe out, and release, and release. Three more, two more, you feel that shoulder working and pulling apart away from each other. One more, hold, and then bring it up, exhale, in breath. Again, keep the shoulder active. Three, two, one, hold. We inhale for a lateral side stretch and exhale back. And an inhale, reach, exhale, inhale, reach, exhale, inhale, reaching out. Exhale, one more each side, exhale, last one, and come back up, stay here. I'm gonna pull that scarf apart, stay, we're gonna bring that scarf overhead, I need to draw that shoulder away from each other, and slide it away, and we go down, inhale, exhale, and an inhale, pull them apart, exhale, and three more, starting to feel some heat radiating out of the shoulder here. And then two, and one, good job. Bring the arms forward and let it go for a second. Shake it out, good job. All right, take them forward again. Here, now what you're gonna do, you're gonna bring one up and the other one down and center. We're gonna inhale, so internal and external rotation at the shoulder, and an inhale, exhale, inhale. You really wanna keep the tension of the towel or the scarf here, and an in-breath, in-breath. Two more sets. Last set, last one. Okay, moving on, twist it. You wanna take it up, center, rotate. Take it up, and the other way, and rotate, rotate, and two more sets. Pull back, you want to pull down as your other arm pull back, so you're counteracting each arm as you do this. And last one, and come back, center hold, pull the arm to your chest here. So bring it closer, keep the shoulder blades apart, and stretch it out. And again, into your chest, exhale. Try not to kiss the shoulder blade to each other, okay? Do your best to keep them apart. So activate your light muscle. Three more. Two more. One more. 
Good job, let it go. Hard work. Okay, it seems simple, but trust me, they're not really, okay? So I want you to just undo the scarf if you did what we did before. I want you to just stretch it up, taking them, taking your hands quite wide. And then from here, I want you to take your arms up, bring the shoulders up, and then if you can, bring the arms back behind you. You may need to take your arms a lot wider than you have now. So try to get the arms over the shoulder and back behind you. If it's too much, you don't have to, you can just stop here and then bring it forward again, okay? But if you can, you come and join me. You can also do this with the terra band. So the elasticity of the band allows you, give you more room to stretch and hence your arms can go further back if you have a tight shoulder. Okay, and then bring it forward. One more, lift it up, shoulders up, and then bring it down, and then shoulders up, and then bring it forward. Well done, okay, moving on to our back. I'm going to fold my scarf in half again to shorten it. Now, so going into our supine position, let's take your arms underneath the bottom, underneath the bottom. Again, you still want to keep the tension of the scarf or the towel. Fit a hip width apart, shoulder nice and broad. I'm reaching away. All right, I want to feel that triceps engaging in this position. All right, breathing in. Exhale, scooping deep, flexing the lower back, imprinting, and then peeling out the spine up to the bridge position. And inhale. Exhale, we melt, melting the spine as you keep reaching the arms away towards the feet. And exhale, melting, sinking the lower back onto the floor as you lift the pelvis and the spine up, working the inner thighs, keeping the knees aligned with the hips. And exhale, we melt, melt, melt and release again. Exhale, sinking the lower back, peeling the spine off, reaching up onto the bridge in breath. Exhale, articulate the spine down. Really try to get that deep flexion in the spine, guys. We go one more time, please. We exhale, melting, drawing up, reaching forward. Towards the knee and the feet, inner thighs are active. And exhale, we go down, down. Okay, moving on. We take one leg up to the tabletop, drawing the center tight, and then bring the second leg up. Again, keeping the tension of the towel. Okay, squeezing the inner thighs. Let's go to some supine spine twist. We're over to me as you inhale, opposite shoulder is down. Exhale, over to the other side, that is my right. Opposite shoulder is down, center. Inhale, exhale, in breath, exhale. In breath, exhale, in breath. You may not go far here, but what you want to focus is to control the twist of the body. So focusing the initiation of the rotation from your waistline here. Your knees and your thighs are still glued together like as though you have only one leg. Over to the back, to the right, that's mine. Exhale, let's do one more each side, and then to the front. Exhale, and to the back, and exhale. Okay, now keeping that tension again, we exhale, lifting the head and the chest for the hundreds prep position. Inhale, three more. Gliding the arms as you fold the chest forward. In breath, two more. In breath, last one. In breath, let's do the hundreds. And exhale, we lift, stretch the legs up. 
and we pump. Keeping the tension of the material and an exhale, reaching the feet to the ceiling. In breath for five, and exhale. And inhale, feel your shoulder broadening out. Widen the shoulder, widen the ribs, grounding the pelvis, reaching the legs away, reaching the arms away. Two more sets. Last set. Now hold, fold the knee, flex the feet, reach the arm forward a little bit more, bring the scarf over your feet. One foot down, second one down, head down, arms overhead. Well done, stretch your legs away. We'll move on to our roll ups here. So we inhale, arm, head up, chest up, arms forward, exhale, lift that center, come up. Up and over into your roll-up position. Your arms are parallel with the ground. Again, you want to create tension in with the towel or the scarf. And an exhale, we roll back, roll back, roll back. Arms overhead. Arms inhale, head lift, chest lift, arms forward, exhale. Sink the low back down as you peel the upper spine over, neck is long. And exhale, roll back. Sink that lower back down and bring your arms overhead. Let's do two more. Arms, head lift, chest lift. If you can't do this, you can bend the knees like so. Okay, maybe today if you need to be. And an exhale, you can also fold the knees with you to give you a little bit of a help here. Okay, if you need it. If you do not, please don't. Let's do the proper traditional way with the legs straight. And exhale, over. And then roll it back. Oh, we meant to stop there. Let's do one more time, sorry guys. All right, so we go arms, head lift, chest lift. And exhale, pull up. Up, 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 hold here, lift the back, adjust the bottom, take the arms overhead and open your legs, wider than your pelvis, slightly wider, reaching up tall, pull the towel apart, and let's go into some spine stretch, so arms up forward, and rounding forward, in breath, exhale, lift, arms to the ceiling, and again, forward, articulate forward, exhale, and up, two more, I'm starting to feel my shoulder burning here guys, and coming up, one more, and exhale, and coming up, we stay, Twisting, center, center, two more set, last set, last one, now a little variation of the soul, we're going to twist here and then we're going to reach and we're gonna bring it up and center. So we're gonna inhale and exhale. So the bottom arm, we're gonna reach down towards the opposite leg and the top arm is gonna to pull you up and support you too. And again, twist bottom arm to the top of the foot and bring it up. Just a variation, it's not the traditional way of doing so. And then up, center, and again, twist and down, up, last one, twist, and down, up, center, and release, shake that shoulders away, okay, let go of the scarf, we don't need it now, save it for later, coming into all four position, your quadruped, okay, Keeping the shoulder broad, shoulder hands aligned, knee and hips aligned, pressing the feet down on the floor. Let's do some scapula push up. So, which means you're just gonna drop the shoulder blade to each other and then push out. So, try to keep the, or try to kiss the shoulder blade with one another and then push it floor. 
and open the shoulder blades apart. So we go, shoulder blades sinking and push. And again, in breath, exhale. And in breath, exhale. Three more. Two more. Last one. And we're going to do a modified push up today. So I want to keep that trunk nice and long, sending the elbows back towards your hips as you lean your body forward. And push the floor away. Let's do eight here. Inhale. Exhale. And an inhale. Exhale. And then lean forward. And exhale. So my shoulders are, are going over in front of the hands. And push. Three more. And push. Keep the shoulder blades nice and supported. And one more here. Inhale. And exhale. Good job. Hold that center. We're going to stretch one leg out into our front support position. Drawing in. Shine the chest forward. And second leg out. We stay in this position. For five. Four. Three. Two. One. Good job. One in, second one in. Okay, now you're going to stretch the left leg out, so the leg closer to the screen. That's my left leg, the front leg, can say that. And pivot your body facing me, the screen. Okay, so like a side kneeling position here. All right, now firmly draw the arms into the shoulder socket here. Neck is long. I want you to press the hands down, anchor the other foot, and lift, extend the bottom foot, bring it behind the other foot, and take the top arm up. We stay here for five. Push the floor away, reach up to the sky. Four. Three. Two, one, all right, bring the underneath knee in, hand down, back to our all four position, over to the other side, so my right leg will stretch out, and I'm going to pivot to the back of the room, all right, and then reach the top arm by the side, all right, pushing the floor away with the bottom hand, pressing the top foot down on the floor and stretch the bottom leg underneath and then taking the top arm with stay. Five, four, really try to pull the arm into your armpit, but I want you to soften the elbows though, so don't go into hip extension. And two more, last one, bottom knee in, all right, and then bring your hand back to all four. Good job, and sit back. All right, bring your leg forward. Okay, so feet are hip width apart, hands behind you. We are going to do modified back support here. Chest is nice and open, proud chest, and we're going to press the hips up. Okay, neck is long, and we're gonna hinge down, keep the chest proud. And again, press the hips up, neck is long, and hinge down. And let's go two more, press up, and down. One more, we're gonna stay up here, hold, lift the right foot up, hold. Three, two, one, place it down, switch. Lift the other leg up, hold, three, two, one, place it down, lift the pelvis, and come on down, good job. Bring the feet together, knee out into a butterfly leg position, and then just reach the arm forward and stretch your back for a second. Let's stay here in two, with, <clears throat> in two sets of breath, inhale, 
exhale, one more, exhale, and walk yourself up. Okay, not finished yet, going on to our front. Okay, so, all right, stretch your legs behind you, hands are forward here. All right, I want you to draw the shoulders and arms back into the mid back. And now keeping the neck long here. So give me a little extension on the upper back. Hold that center, stretch the legs away. And then we're gonna take the right arm and down. And the left, like swimming, but just with the arm. And down, neck is long and down and down and two more sets last set and well done release grab your scarf or your towel now let's have your hands behind your back and the towel behind you so keep your hand rather close with each other here okay stretch your legs away all right, so we're going to keep pressing the legs down onto the floor. I want you to reach the arms, slide your arms to the small of the back and down to your thigh, and we'll lift the arms. Neck is long, and down, and then release. Again, inhale, reach into an extension, and up. Arm down, and release. And again, inhale, lift, up, down, and release. Three more. L up, down, and release. Two more. Keep the tension of the scarf. The closer your hands are to each other, the better it is. And again, lift, up, and then down. Last one. Lift, up, down, and release. Well done. Let go. Hands on the side of the shoulder. Help yourself up. Coming back into an all four here, and then we're going to finish with a stretch. So, I'm gonna slide the right hand through underneath the left armpit towards me, to the screen, and then bring your shoulder down, and then stretch the top arm. I call this thread a needle stretch. So making a little pretzel in your body. So really actively reaching the right arm away from your shoulder and the left arm overhead. Stay one more breath here. And then bring the top arm down or back and the other side. And again, left hand underneath the right arm, slide it through the gap, reach away, shoulders down, and then reach the top arm, my right arm away, overhead. Inhale, exhale, we got one more. Inhale, and exhale. Okay, bring the arm back, push the floor away, and then sit back onto your child pose, sorry, your rest position. And we got one set of breath here. And exhale melting 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 and roll your body up good job thank you for joining me on the mat today i hope you're feeling your shoulder and your arm i certainly did and i hope to see you on the mat again another class in this channel leave me a comment if you have any questions or any feedback and have a great day thank you